Greetings, cannabis lovers. I'm Donald, and I'm back. <laughs> this is my channel, Cannabis Bananabis. Uh, I've been away for three years, almost to the day. It's now August 5th, 2020, in the middle of a pandemic. I quit posting to this channel uh, because I left my apartment and um, forced my financial hardship into living in a van with my disabled son. So uh, we have been living in a ghetto. It was a terrible, dangerous place. And uh, it was taking all our money. I'm retired. My son is disabled. I didn't think we were ever going to get out of there, at least not alive. But I managed to uh, scrape together a couple thousand bucks, buy an old van, gut it, build it out, moved into it, and we got out of that place. And we've been living rent-free for three years. That's soon to change. We're about to go back into an apartment in a couple of months. And then I'll start growing indoors again. But um, So we were living on the road. We are doing a lot of traveling uh, out in the Rocky Mountains and out in the desert. And... Uh, uh, actually making the most out of living in a van life, it's really pretty good uh, if you can adjust to it. For me, it was like one long camping trip, and it was great. I have, an, I have a second channel. It's called Vangasmic Voyage on YouTube, and it's all about our lives transitioning from ghetto life in an apartment to freedom and liberation in a van and travel. And uh, I think you'll find it interesting. It's called Vangasmic Voyage. Got some nice travel uh, videos there from some of the most beautiful places on Earth. Anyway, back to cannabis. So um, now we've been forced off the road. We got forced out of our apartment, and now we've been forced off the road. Not, te I mean, technically, we're not. We can drive, but there's nowhere to go. In this pandemic, all the campgrounds are closed. All the federal national parks, federal land, Bureau of Land Management. Um, the camping has either been closed or restricted severely. Uh, there's no Planet Fitness. We were using Planet Fitness locations for our showers. Uh, they're all closed. Uh, I think some of them are starting to reopen, but I am not going to feel safe traveling again until there are widespread vaccinations, because right now it's a mess out there. We're in northern Maine. I bought this property in 2009. I bought a pretty little piece of land it's just a little slice of heaven it's eight tenths of an acre and uh, i paid cash for it i paid five thousand dollars the only thing that was on the land was an outhouse but that's essential so i bought the land i uh, i got a little two room uh, camp here um but it's not habitable year round there's no heat there's no insulation there's no electricity um and we're fetching right now we're fetching our water from the spring so we're going to have to get into an apartment uh, in Bangor. We'll be in the Bangor area uh, because rents are affordable up here. Forget about Massachusetts. We were living in Massachusetts. And forget about that, man. We, we got priced out of the market completely down in Massachusetts. Unless you want to live in a hovel in a dangerous ghetto. <laughs> no thanks. So we came up here in April. And um, as soon as it got warm enough to sprout seeds outdoors... I sprouted some cannabis. Uh, I got a grape ape going there and a few um, black eyed Katie. And uh, I have a video on that coming right up after this. This is just to reintroduce myself to my channel and my viewers. While I was away from this channel for three years doing the Van Gasmic Voyage thing, uh, I really hadn't paid any attention to this channel at all. And when I, when I last posted, I think I had like maybe a hundred subscribers and I was maybe getting like a half a dozen views per channel. So recently uh, I got a comment, I left the channel up. I didn't know when or if I was ever gonna be back to this channel again, but I left it up and I got a comment. Every now and then I'd get a comment um, and uh, I went to reply to it and I realized that that video had 10,000 views on it. I'm like, what? <laughs> And then I looked at my other videos on this, on this channel, and there's like 9,000 views, 8,000, 4, 5, 6,000 views. It's like, what happened? I haven't even been here, and the place has gone wild. So it's time for me to put more energy back into this channel, 
and hopefully pick up some more subscribers. You know, I, I've been beating my head against the wall with that Van Gasmic Voyage channel. There's a million van dwelling channels out there and RV channels. It's hard to get noticed. And uh, I only have about, I don't know, 340 something subscribers and I'm lucky if I get 20 views on a video. So uh, that channel doesn't seem to be going anywhere, but man, I, uh, while I wasn't looking, I racked up thousands of views on this channel. So hopefully uh, I can get subscribes as subscriptions up to uh, a thousand so I can monetize the account. Um, I, I don't need the money to keep the channel running. I didn't need the money to keep the channel going for my van dwelling channel, but um, you know, I'm 69 years old. I'm on a fixed income. Any any extra money is good money. So, uh, yeah, so stay tuned. We're going to finish up this grow here. Uh, we'll probably be back in an apartment in about two months. I'm going to set up my little grow tent. I'm going to buy another big grow tent. I'm going to buy a 3x3x7 three by three by gorilla tent. And uh, and I'm going to grow some serious cannabis. Maine has recreational, recreational cannabis. You're allowed to grow. They... It, they passed that law in four years ago. They approved recreational. They still don't have a single dispensary selling recreational. It's still only medical. But you're allowed to cultivate. So I got a few plants growing in my yard here. And uh, when we get back into the apartment, I'll go back into it uh, in a big way. So stay tuned. Stick around. We'll have some fun. Peace and out.